Good Monday morning, everyone. I'm Tina Jennings. And I'm Heather Stricker. Well, most of the time people think about health insurance just during open enrollment, and then the rest of the year, it's sort of out of sight, out of mind, right? But there actually may be a problem with that. Yeah, even though the season for Medicare and individual open enrollment may be over, here to tell us about special cases where consumers might be eligible for coverage, as well as other health care services, is VP of Marketing for Berwick Insurance Group, Hi. Colleen Gimble. Hi, Hi guys. Thank you for coming <laughs> back. Thank you. I was just telling you before the show uh, started, we get phone calls, Facebook messages, email messages from so many of our viewers asking about these segments because it is. There is a problem about just thinking about insurance mm -hmm. just during open enrollment. Right. And yeah. people start realizing that after these segments and they're like, I need that phone number again. <laughs> I need that information again. So let's tell people why you shouldn't be just, just thinking about it during that time. Well, and there's a lot of reasons. Number yeah. one, um, but the most important is, um, if we're talking Medicare, people are turning 65 every day. Yeah. Um, we have close to 90,000 people going to turn 65 in our state this year, just in Arizona. So those people can start looking at plans um, 30 days out or 90 days out, or six months out. I mean, you can really start to plan ahead, and you have your own kind of special, uh, what we call an initial enrollment period. Um, people who are low income subsidy or maybe on a, on access or something like that here, they may also, if they're Medicare eligible, be eligible for a plan that gets partially funded by the state and a carrier. So there's a lot of people who become eligible that may not even understand or realize that they are. Um, when it comes to uh, individual, there has to be a qualifying event. So you have to move or something has to happen. Maybe you lose your group coverage. Um, as far as group business goes, we are doing, I mean, groups, uh, agencies, um, are always looking to renew once a year. They have to go through it. But a lot of people that own businesses, I mean, obviously have other things to think about than their health benefits. Mm -hmm. um, so they just renew. They just renew, they renew. And if you can really have somebody come in and maybe somebody with fresh eyes that hasn't looked at it before. We had a case where they had had the same agent for 20 years or something and they were actually losing a lot of money and they by talking to us our group department found out that they could save them money and save their employees money and make their benefits better so those are the kinds of things that we do at berwick and we're always you know on the health insurance side we're always looking for ways to get people the best coverage at the best price or the lowest possible you know, output for them, which is a real challenge for people these days because oh, yeah. insurance has Absolutely. gotten really crazy. And we've seen it firsthand with our viewers getting it. And I have to say, I always love your website, weknowhealthinsurance.com. Thank you, yes. So let's really break it down and talk about all the different kinds of health insurance that you do help people get. Sure, so health insurance in general, group individual and Medicare. Um, the other uh, things that people don't realize or that you can get um, as well are hospital indemnity plans. And you can um, get a hospital indemnity plan from the age of 40 to 85. And so this is actually what those plans do, they're real low pre premium, like just depending on how much coverage you want, but they're very, very affordable and they help people cover the cost if they get have to go into the hospital. So you have like a daily um, uh, minimum that you have to pay when you're in the hospital, uh, a copay basically. Uh, and those can get up to three or $400 a day depending on your plan. So if you have this hospital indemnity plan, it can cover the cost of that for maybe you know, 20 or $30 a month. So it's, you know, there's a lot of different things. So that's one thing that people don't think about. Final expense is another one that I've really never talked about here. And final expense is for people, they're basically sort of funeral plans, final, uh, final plans. Funerals can cost, even a very modest funeral can cost $10,000. And people just don't typically have that money sitting aside. So if you don't have coverage, and those are also really affordable plans. So those are some different kinds of insurance that we help with as well. There's also, of course, life insurance. Everybody knows about that. Um, and then we also have a sister company that is property and casualty. So auto and home, um, commercial, um, RV, motorcycle. I mean, you can, you know, you name it, <laughs> we can cover it pretty much. So we've got it all going on. We got all kinds of yeah. insurance. <laughs> well, and so I, what we call in this business is kind of bearing the lead because the best <laughs> thing to me, the shiny thing about you coming on is we talk about what is the advantage of coming to Berwick and does it cost me money to come to you? And you know, how do I know if you're the right person to help me? This is the shiny thing. Yeah. What do you, what it do I It doesn't cost you? anything to nothing. use our services. Right, nothing. You don't pay us a thing. We get compensated by our carriers. Um, we represent multiple carriers, so it's not a just a one size fits all. There's a lot of different 
types of plans, whether you're talking auto and home to, you know, the final expense. I mean, there's so many different things that you can use. And I think the hard part about insurance is nobody really wants to talk about insurance that much. I mean, we find it exciting because we do it all the time, but, but nobody else really wants to talk about insurance. So they put it off and they put yeah. it off. And there's some funny commercials on television even putting off, you know, talking about your retirement and, you know, what kind of plans you're going to need. And so um, the more that we can get people to just not be scared and just pick up the phone. It's not 10 hours of your life. It's maybe an hour for us to really sit down. Even with a group, um, a business owner, you know, somebody can pick up the phone and just say, hey, where do we start? And, and you know, we make sure that you're compliant, you know, if you're a business owner and we're talking group again now, but, you know, we make sure you're meeting all of the requirements that the government has set forth. So those are the things that that we do that you don't have to worry about anything else. Yeah. You just have to remember our phone number or go to our website and, and give us a call and, and, it, and it's free to you. I mean, it doesn't cost you anything to use our services, so. So many reasons to call you. I love, you know, I love, a lot of times we're talking to our seniors specifically, but yeah. today we are really talking to everybody. everybody. Individuals, yeah. business owners, everybody. So hopefully you're gonna get a lot more calls today. I hope today. so, our yeah. phone rings all the time when I'm here, so I'm really <laughs> glad to be here. I appreciate awesome. you guys helping us get the word out to, to our, you know, our, our two, fellow Tucsonans here and, and uh, we're so glad that uh, that we're able to do this. And we're going to make sure they have all that information again. Colleen, thank right. you again thank for you joining so us. Much, guys. And for more information about Berwick Insurance Group, you can call 745-2300 or visit their website, weknowhealthinsurance.com.